Hey guys, welcome back to Bumbling Panda and to our sixth week of the 10 dresses and 10 week summer sewing series. Today we're making this zippered chiffon dress, so let's get started on this tutorial. For this project, I'm using one yard of a chiffon fabric and one yard of a lining fabric. So starting with the chiffon fabric folded in half, I'm cutting out a basic tank dress shape. Of course, I cut out two pieces, one for the front and one for the back. Taking only one piece, I fold it in half and drop the neckline by a few inches. This will make it my front piece. Next, I cut the exact front and back pieces in lining fabric. The lining fabric I'm using is just a simple jet set knit, which is very affordable and I bought it at Joann's. So when I cut the lining fabric of the front piece, I also make sure to drop the front neckline like I did with the front piece of the main fabric of the dress. Next, with the chiffon and lining pieces, right sides facing each other, I pinned and sewed down the outer edges. I do not do this to the bottom, of course, so only sew the outer edges except for the bottom. Once the pieces are sewn together, I flip the pieces right side out. Do this with the front and back piece of the dress. Next, I placed both pieces right sides facing each other and pinned and sewed one side seam. Then I laid that seam flat and I'm going to install an invisible zipper. I pinned one side of the zipper on one side of the seam. Next, using an invisible zipper foot, I'm going to sew that one side of the invisible zipper to one side of the seam of the dress. Then I sewed the other side of the zipper to the other side of the seam. So it's probably easier to do this next step with a seam ripper, but I just use a pair of scissors and cut through the seam threads. Do not cut the zipper, of course. I cut this down to where the zipper ended. Then I placed the dress flat with the right sides facing each other and I pinned and sewed the shoulders and the other side seam of the dress. Now 
Then I made sure that the hem was even and then I went ahead and finished the bottom of the dress. And that's it, I'm done, yay! I'm going to show you what the dress looks like here. If you want to see more pictures of the dress, please go to my blog, bumblingpanda.com, and I will see you next Tuesday. Bye!